I was very good friend with Maurice Lapidus, an eternal optimist. And thanks again, like Bonnie, he lived long enough to, be, to feel his recognition. He had troubles with the architects at the Bauhaus and from Mies van der Rohe that saw him like, uh, you know, entertaining the masses. What are you doing making happy places? Oh, wow. So he had the last laugh. He's the one most imitated now. He created this place, the Fontainebleau Hilton, the Eden Rock, that I actually went in 71, 72, the first time I, I was in a plane from Puerto Rico, and I'll never forget. And the beauty of, of having your thoughts in order, I always wanted to meet him, and I did, because he was there one day visualizing. And he used to come to Imperfect Utopia on Lincoln Road. And I will show Morris. Morris, look at this anthology of architecture. They mention you. And he was so happy in this book of 200 pages that he had a little picture of it. And they mentioned him. There was nothing else on Morris back then. Your Morris just live, live long enough. You're important. Before he knew it, he had a call to all the artists. He had done the renovation in Lincoln Road. I actually had the book in the speakeasy that he signed. He signed those, those little anthologies in architecture. I will make him sign it. Eventually he has biography. Too much is never enough. And he lived long enough to see an apologetic letter. I don't remember which of the architects. I think it missed or something like this. It's in his book. He talks about it, how misunderstood he was.